one of the most fascinating behaviors happening on reef systems all across the tropical world is the cleaning station. Here in Hawaii, there are multiple animals that make their living as cleaners. However, the two main obligatory cleaners in Hawaii are the Hawaiian cleaner wrasse, Labroides therophagus, and the scarlet cleaner shrimp, Lismata emboinensis. A cleaner's job in life is to pick all the dead skin cells, bacteria, and parasites off all the other fish. They get their food that way, while all the other fish get a shower. At night, many reef fish go down deep in the cracks and crevices of the coral for safety. While they're sleeping, tiny little ectoparasites living amongst the coral heads come out and crawl all over the reef fish. The parasites will commonly lodge themselves near the fish's fins and their gill slits. When the fish wake up in the morning, they don't have fingers to just go easily pluck off the parasites. So what do they do? They show up at a cleaning station and the cleaners eat them off. Cleaner rats will do a special dance to attract fish to their cleaning station. While cleaner shrimp advertise their services by waving their long antennae at all passing fish. Virtually all inhabitants of the reef get cleaned at some point during the day. In exchange, cleaners seem to enjoy almost total immunity from predation. It's almost as if they're protected by the mob down there. Watch the trust that goes on in this relationship. Even the predatory fish need to be cleaned. The Hawaiian green sea turtle enjoys a much different form of cleaning. In some areas of Hawaii, the turtles have formed an unbelievable symbiotic relationship with multiple species of reef fish. One by one, and sometimes in a group, turtles show up at a specific spot on the reef to have their shells groomed by teams of surgeonfish and parrotfish. This action lightens the load for the turtles, while at the same time, provides a healthy treat for the cleaners. Cleaning stations play an integral part in the maintenance of a healthy reef ecosystem. Most cleaners' instincts are so strong that if the right human comes along, they may even clean them.